everybody. I am known as a minimalist packer. Um, I travel a lot and I kind of have packing down. People don't understand how I do things. Um, mostly like how I can look cute and have a bunch of outfits and have the makeup while also only having like one bag. So I am doing as all New Yorkers do, and that's leaving New York. Um, everybody leaves in the summer. So I got a, a house in Maine. It's a little cottage in Freeport. A lot of people know that that's where like L.L. Bean outlet is. <laughs> Anyways, I leave today. I'm driving, but I'm not driving from the city. I am uh, rented a car from New Jersey. And what I really like to do for New York is usually I take taxis to and from the airport, but since I'm driving, um, I don't want to like, I don't want a lot to carry. I like to be able to carry it on my body um, because going up and down the, the stairs with a rolly is kind of annoying. I usually pack based on what's important to me at the time. So you guys are going to see a lot of makeup and a lot of beauty products. That's what I'm into right now. When I had blonde hair, it was all about the hair because that's like, you know, doing hair maintenance was a lot. Um, make, making sure I use the right shampoos and conditioners and masks and things like that. But um, right now I'm into beauty and I just got a new set of brushes from Amazon. So I want to try that. So I have like my normal brushes and then I have a pack of the new brushes. So I don't usually travel with two brushes. Um, I'm really into vlogging and podcasting right now, so I have all of my camera equipment. For me, packing this time was a little different because it's my first time traveling with all of this equipment, including the tripod that you are watching me from right now. As far as the clothes and makeup and beauty and stuff, I pretty much have that down, but um, I haven't quite worked out the, the camera and the podcasting yet. For example, this is um, my recorder, but... I'm not sure if I'm gonna bring this, it's like pretty heavy. So we'll find out when I pack it all in, but I wanted to give you a walkthrough just because um, I travel for months sometimes and I only have like one carry-on bag and my, um, and my work bag and people are like, how, how long are you traveling? And kind of like don't understand. Anyways, so I wanted to give you a rundown. To me, what's really important is having all of my comforts and luxury items. I really love to take care of myself. I love to wind down at night by just, you know, like doing a face mask and spending a lot of time on my routine. I also do that in the mornings with my like skincare and then beauty, um, like makeup. And so I like to spend a lot of time doing that. A couple things I did do is I, I rent the runway and my four of my outfits were shipped to Maine already. So those will be waiting for me when I get there. That's a trick that you can do. You could just ship your clothes. And then I have four outfits here. So I'm very um, a minimalist packer. I like to look really cute. I like to wear something new every day, but I also like to travel light. Um, one way I do that is by packing, like I, I use, um, I'll only pack, like an outfit for me will be a dress and a pair of shoes and then I'll accessorize or I'll like do up my makeup or do my hair. That really helps me cut down on like the amount of things that I need to bring because I don't have to pack multiple like shirts or multiple pants. I kind of already have my, uh, my outfit by just packing a dress or packing a jumper and that's it. So that's one of my, two of my tricks. I always bring a lot of underwear, like way more than I need. I'm psycho about having clean under underwear. I'll bring like, like I'm, I'm going for eight days, but I'll, I'll bring like 12 pair or more. Um, underwear is really light, so I don't have a problem carrying it. I mean, that's pretty much it. So let me give you a walkthrough. Okay. So I use, um, I'm going to be using two Koyana bags. There's this one, and then there's this bag. Um, they look huge because I'm on the close-up lens right now. But they pack a lot of, of stuff. So um, I have a lot of space. This bag is my work bag. I 
keep my laptop, my journal, um, my glasses, and my cords. So in that little cosmetic case is my Wi-Fi device and my cell phone charging cords. Um, we'll move on to beauty, my brush, and my period cup. All of this is my makeup. So I'm obsessed with lipsticks. This bag right here is just full of lipsticks. This one, <laughs> this one is my face makeup, beauty blender, and then these two are brushes. Um, I can do a video if you're interested on what my essential makeup items are. Here's beauty. Um, that's just skincare and and night routine. So in this white bag here, I have like all my masks that I do at night, the ones that I sleep in. Um, I have a bunch of face masks just because I like to do those at least like one a day. They make me feel really good. Um, I pack one pair of shoes plus I wear one pair of shoes. This is my camera stuff. So that's my tripod. It comes in this, uh, let's see, this bag here that'll fit in the carry-on and then this is my little um, my little pouch that I keep my long lens and this is an external hard drive that I'll probably end up popping in my work bag. These are my clothes. I did one pair of workout gear. Um, it dries really quickly. I can wear it more than once. Um, it doesn't smell. I did a year of wearing, no joke, I did one year of wearing the same pants, and so that year, if you would have seen me packing, I would have just packed a backpack. Here are, here are my outfits. I know they don't look like much, but um, this is a robe that I love to get ready in. I wear it every single day. I have a few robes, but this one's my fave. It was a gift. And that's what I do my beauty routine in. And then I have a dress and a jumper and a summer shirt that is a boy shirt that I actually tie. Um, these are my favorite snacks. If I'm traveling by car and I have to drive a little bit, I'm going to get hungry. And I don't, sometimes I like stopping, but sometimes I don't. But these are my favorite snacks. They're uh, dry, salted almonds, mango, and chocolate, of course. And that's it. That's all I'm packing. I know, it doesn't seem like that much, but so that's basically it. Um, it's not that much, and it'll take me through the entire week. Um, oh, I, I have a bathing suit in here somewhere, too, um, sometime. I'm not, sure if I'll, I'm not sure if I'll hit the pool or the beach, but sometimes I like to wear my bathing suit top under, like, a shirt like this, where I'll, like, leave it unbuttoned a little bit, and then it'll peek through. Um, it just makes something like that's kind of baggy and boyish a little bit more cute. And that's about it, guys. That's how I pack. I always pack my shoes in a plastic bag, obviously. And I'm obsessed. Like, I've had this bag since I was like 14 or 15. It's a transversion bag by NYC Loop. Um, I can't find them anywhere, but I'm about to retire this bag and frame it um, just because it's literally been around the world more than once with me. And I, I just, it's my favorite. If anybody finds bags, transversion bags, particularly in this blue color, um, please snag them up for me and contact me. Uh, I used to have the entire collection but in my minimalist phase, I got rid of all of them. And I'm really, really, really sad about it because had I known that they would last me this long and that I would want more and they wouldn't be available, I would have kept them. Anyways, these are the best bags. So uh, let me know if you find them. <laughs> I've been looking everywhere. So yeah, I'm gonna get to packing. I'll show you how it all comes out and turns out. And um, yeah, thanks for watching.